it's 11 to 8. Gallatin hits a three to end the quarter. Glad you could join us here on Charter Communication Channel 6. Guys, don't go anywhere. we got three more quarters of action. We'll have the second quarter for you here in just a moment. We're back underway for the second quarter as Gallatin has the ball to start the quarter. Smith has it, gets it over to Clark. He'll shoot that three again. He misses it this time, and Bridges with a great offside blockout. He gets it over to Beetle. No look pass over to Manning for a wide open three from the left wing. He hits it off the back iron. He tries to run down his own rebound, but a good blockout in there by Fields, who just checked into the game. Devin Fields for the green wave. Beetle's going to come away with the ball now. And another good looking, no look pass. And High's going to finish it off as he tips the ball in. Beetle faked me out on that one a little bit. Of course, that's not very hard to do. Yeah, you're right, Tick. You're a smart man. Gray has the ball, gets it over on the right wing to Smith. Now back up top to Clark. He'll shoot that three from the top of the key off the front iron again. Manning all by himself about the free throw line to grab that one. Hands it off to Bridges. He'll walk it across the half-court line. Gallatin staying in their half-court man-to-man defense. Bridges working against Smith. Gets it over to Manning on the left wing. Hoffinger runs the baseline. Beetle over here on the right wing. Manning still with the ball at the top of the key. Looking. Now he hands it off to Beetle. He takes it right into the gut. Another pass over to Hoffinger. He'll shoot that three. It's good. Beetle really showing off the passing skills tonight. A very underrated passer, in my opinion. I got him with three assists so far. Three assists, and Gallatin wants to talk about it. 13 to 11. Lebanon opens up with a 6-0 run in the second quarter. 6.26 left to go. We'll be back in just a moment. 6.26 left to go here in the second period. 13-11, Lebanon leads. Gallatin with the ball. They'll give it to Smith in the backcourt. Stafford checks back into the ball game along with Sloan for Lebanon. Over on the left wing to Fields. Now they get it back over to Perry at the top of the key. He'll give it back over to Matthews. And he'll go back up top to Perry once again at the top of the key. Lebanon standing a man-to-man -man defense over on the right wing to Matthews. Now down in the corner to Smith. He dribbles it back out. Bounce passes over to Perry. Now over to Ray. Down, down in the corner to Matthews. He'll drive the baseline go all the way to the rim. We're going to get a blocking foul on high. And Matthews is going to step to line with a chance to tie this ball game up for his ball club. That was Cameron High's second foul. Well, that's not good if you're a Lebanon fan. Lebanon doesn't have a whole lot of options down there on the low block. And oh. Matthews absolutely misses that one by about a foot. I'd say about two feet. Yeah, he's uh, he's gripping that arm. He, he went down hard on that, on that uh, drive right there on the foul. Had a lot of body weight fall on that arm. He nails that one. Matthews, a pretty good-looking athlete, running the point for Gallatin. Yeah, that first foul shot, my neck, you could have thrown up. <laughs> Bridges, or is Beetle with the ball, head fakes, drives in, now gets it over to Stafford. He'll shoot a three out of the corner. It's on the way off the front. I know, gets his own rebound, the smallest man on the court. Gets his own rebound and lays it up. Great hustle by Jordan Stafford. Matthews now at the ball for Gallatin. He's going to get it across the half-court line. Excuse me, that's Smith, not Matthews. Over on the right wing to Perry. Now back up top to Matthews. Now over here on the left wing to Smith. And Stafford almost takes it away, but it falls right into Ray's hands. And he throws up a little running hook, and it goes in. And Gallatin pulls it within one. Stafford now running the point. And he also caught K. Sloan's face in the frog process there. K. Sloan, not somebody I'd want to make too angry at me. He's a, he's a big kid now. Vance with an open three out of the corner, and he's going to nail it. Nice speed from Stafford. Absolutely. He drew the defense in, and that's two or three times we've seen him do that now as the senior really getting some PT tonight. And this time, Gallatin not going to be able to find the handle down low as they try to get a bounce pass to Woodard. He couldn't hold on to it. Beetle has the ball now, gets it across the half-court line. Wants a pick. No one's there to give it to him. Oh, and a great – oh. Vance came open momentarily, but his man stayed with him pretty good. Lebanon will get the ball back. Checking into the ball game. For Gallatin is going to be Hunter Goad, number 22. Goad, who else checked in? 
Is that the only one? Uh, I believe Woodard checks back in. Woodard checked back in. Okay. Stafford gets the ball over to Bridges on the right wing. Man-to-man -man defense by Gallatin. Bridges drives to his left. Hands it back over to Stafford. He's going to bring it back up at the top of the key and set up the offense for Lebanon. Lebanon running all four of their guys down low, wanting Stafford to take his man one-on-one. -on -one. Stafford can't shake him. Gets it back over to Bridges. Bridges guarded by Clark, one-on-one. -on -one. Hands it off to Vance. Vance tries to get inside. Fake the spin move. Hands it back over to Stafford. Stafford gets down that baseline again. Nowhere to go with it. Picks up his dribble. Gets it back out top to Vance. Now over to Sloan on the left wing. Sloan gets it down to Manning on the block. Manning with a nice power move, but he's partially blocked, but they're going to call a blocking foul on Woodard. I believe that might be Woodard's third foul. No, second. Second foul. Manning will step to the line, the senior. Chance to extend this Lebanon lead. First shot is on the way, and it is off. No good. He'll have another. Glad you could join us here on Charter Communication Channel 6. Guys, I am John Boyce, joined alongside my man Jet Thompson, who's been helping me out all season. This will quite possibly be our last broadcast. As Manning hits his second, and Clark's going to come open, streaking down the court, tries to spin move and walks with it. He knew it. So did everybody else in the crowd. And Lebanon will have the ball again with 3.40 and counting left to go here in the first half. 18 to 14, Lebanon lead. Manning had missed both on the other end, and uh, Matthews got the rebound on the second. Cross-court pass over to Vance at the top of the key. Thought about a three-head fake. Now they get it back over to Bridges on the right wing. He'll dribble back out. Now he tries to get into the paint. Picks up his dribble. Nowhere to go with it. Gets over to Sloan on the left wing. Sloan back over to Vance. Now back over to the left wing to Stan uh, uh, Stafford. Stafford. He just got it back. Now back over to Manning. Uh, he'll kick it over to Bridges on the left wing. He'll shoot a three, and it's good. Two threes in the ball game now for Justin Bridges. And Matthews will bring it across for Gallatin. We're going to get to man-to-man -man defense. Both teams stayed in that man-to-man. -man. Matthews does a great cross job on Bridges. Almost got it to go, and Fance is going to track the ball down. And he's going to take it across the half-court line himself. Takes it down to the right wing. No one picks him up. He's going to shoot it. Misses it. Gets his own rebound. He's going to hand it to Bridges. Bridges is going to shoot from the same spot he misses. Sloan's down there to rebound. He has nowhere to go with it, and he's going to call a timeout. Great hustle by Kay Sloan there as he gets the timeout. 2.29 left to go here in the first period, or excuse me, first half. 21 to 14, Lebanon lead. We'll be back at Camel Brennan Gymnasium in just a few moments. A lot of sweetness in the gym tonight as Lebanon women pulled out a huge win over Gallatin. Lebanon men now with the lead early, or I should say late in the first half. Lebanon's going to turn it over off that inbounds pass as Beetle tried to go to Vance in the corner. Both teams now have six turnovers. Six turnovers for both teams. Thank you, Jeff. Both teams doing a somewhat decent job of taking care of the ball. Good. Goad with the ball. Gets it inside to Fields. Goes across court over to Matthews. Tries to dribble back in. Pulls it back out. Gets it over to Clark. He dribbles in. Does a hop step off the backboard. No good. It's going to bounce around. Manning finally going to come away with it. And he's Tackled at the two-yard line as Clark comes away limping a little bit from that as well. I think that was inadvertent. Clark was trying to get down the court. And Manning happened to be standing there and couldn't dribble the ball, and Clark just kind of ran into him. It's going to be Clark's first foul, team's fourth. As Bridges walks it across the half-court line, Galton staying in that man-to-man -man defense. They get over to Sloan on the left wing. Try to get a backdoor cut by Bridges. Now he gets a pick for Manning up top. Now he throws it down to Manning. Great pass and great finish. Bridges to Manning. The two seniors working that pick and roll beautifully. Go down with the ball. Now he, they get it over here on the left wing to Clark. Back over to go to the top of the key. He dribbles in. Nowhere to go with it. Backs it back out. Gets a backdoor cut and it's going to be thrown out of bounds by Goat. He tried to go to Matthews as they tried to run that V cut was there momentarily, but the pass a little off target. Seven turnovers now for Gallatin in the ball game. As Bridges were walking across the timeline with just 
Under a minute 20 left to go here in the first half. 23-14, Lebanon leads. Trying to push this thing out to double digits before half. Manning with the ball on the left wing. Gets it over to Vance. He'll get a pick for Manning. He'll go to the top of the key. Picks up his dribble. Now goes over on the right wing to Bridges. Trying to go down a little to Sloan. Can't do it. Now they swing it across over to Manning on the left wing. He dribbles in. Now gets it in the corner to Vance. Now they get it inside to Sloan. A great catch by Sloan. A little one-handed catch. I bet Sloan could play a little tight end. He had that one-handed catch right there, holding his man off, does get fouled on the play. That foul's gonna go on Ray, his first, team's fifth, as Beatles sets in, bounce underneath his own basket. They get it to Sloan in the corner, now they get it over to Bridges, try to get it to Bridges, it's batted around, and Gallatin's gonna come away with it, we're gonna get a foul. And they're gonna call the foul on Ray. A lot of loose ball fouls here in this half. Lebanon fortunate that most of them have gone against Gallatin. Checking back into the ball game is Smith. He'll check in for Ray, I believe it was. Lebanon going to inbound underneath their own basket. Still got the same box set. Different personnel. They get it into High, who just checked into the game. He's going to take a power dribble up and gets the shot off. Doesn't go, but he's going to be fouled. So now Cameron High will have a chance to push this thing out to double digits before the half. Gallatin, barring they do get the rebound off of the foul shot, will have a chance uh, maybe for a couple shots with 51 seconds left to go here in the first half. Seventh team foul on Gallatin. They will be in the bonus for the short while here left in the first period. Now it is a double digit lead, 24-14. First made foul shot by Lebanon tonight. Off how many attempts? This will be the fourth. Well, that's not good. Second shot's good. There we go. Two for five. Slowly pulling that percentage up. Two or four, 50 percent. Uh, two or four now. Okay. I got that quick math, Jet. Smith with the ball, working against Bridges, hands it off to Clark. He crosses his man over, loses the dribble. Bridge, er, uh, Beetle with a good job handing that thing off to Manning before he walked as he dove on the ground. Gets it over to Vance on the right wing. Hands it off to Bridges. He'll take it over back to the top of the key. Now he hands it over to Manning. A little weave going on by Lebanon as they try to get that back door cut, it looks like. Now Beetle with the ball. He's going to hand it off to Bridges. He's at the devil head at center court. Lebanon wanting to hold for that last shot and take a two-point or two-digit lead into halftime. Beetle loses the handle. Matthews comes away with it. And they're going to call a goaltend. As Manning was going up for the block on Matthews, and he got it on the way down. A bailout that time as Matthews was kind of out of control and just had to kind of chuck it up before he walked. And they cut it down to a nine-point lead. 11 and six seconds left to go here in the half. We try to get a shot off. Vance with the ball gets it across the half-court line. It's going to be stolen by Matthews. He's going to chuck it up. And it's no good from center court. That's going to do it for the first half, guys. Lebanon leads 25 to 16. Don't go anywhere. We'll, we'll have your scoring summary here at Camel Brennan Gymnasium right here on Charter Communication Channel 6 in just a moment. Welcome back into Camel Brennan Gymnasium as they honor the women athlete of the weeks down below. That's Katie Williams and Julia Fox from the girls team. They had a heck of an outing earlier as they won the game 70 to 35. Here in this game, though, we're at the half. Lebanon leads 25 to 16. Jet Thompson here to tell us how we got there. Gown and Green waiver led in scoring by Durante Clark. He had eight. Devontae Ray had four. Cody Matthews with three. And Anthony Woodard with one. For Lebanon, it was Cameron High with six. Brian Beadle, Justin Bridges, Philip Vance, and Carlos Hoffinger had three. Jordan Stafford had five. Coming off the bench to start tonight, instead of sitting on the bench to start, as it is senior night. And Justin Manning had two. So once again, high six, Stafford five, Beetle, Bridges, Vance, and Hopping were three, Manning two. 